in my sister's room, they have an air hockey table. So I thought, wouldn't it be neat if I could have that in my room? But I have a small bedroom, and I wouldn't be able to fit both in there. So my mom said, you're going to have to make a choice. Is it going to be the bed or the game table? Well, I picked the game table. <laughs> she said, that's fine, but where are you going to sleep? So that's when I had an idea, and the light bulb went off. Oh. <laughs> Let's see it, Kyle. So this is your bed. <laughs> yeah. Right? What happens then? Um, well, so you pull these pins. Give it a flip. Thank you. That's fantastic. What a wonderful idea. Very, very smart. Well, Thank it you. Takes, it what? takes up less space. So. Of course it does. We should do that with all of our furniture. With every single thing <laughs> in the house, it should be something else underneath. Don't you think? Work on it. All right. <laughs> Nice to meet you. How old are you? Where do you live? I'm eight and I live in Marlboro, Connecticut. Okay, and what grade are you in? I'm in third grade. Third grade. All right, let me see what you have. What'd you invent and how come? I invented the fashion friend because in the morning I had a problem. You had a, you had a problem and this is called the fashion? Friend. Friend. Okay, let's see the fashion friend. So you'd put, to see what it looks like on you before mm -hmm. you put it on you, you, you don't want to walk out of the house until you see what other people see. What is, you know, there's mirrors, but you can't always, <laughs> you can't count on mirrors all the time. That's a great idea, your fashion friend. That's beautiful. You can change it and you can try different things on and go, well, what, what if I wore that with a jean? That's great. It saves you time. Put it on the fashion friend. Hi, you must be Kyle. Yep. Hi, Kyle. How old are you? Where do you live? What, what grade are you in? I'm 11 years old. I'm in the fifth grade and I live in Mandelboro, Connecticut. All right, great. And what do you have here? Laptop levitator. Laptop levitator. Okay, and what made you come up with this idea? Um, my mom's friend has back problems, mm -hmm. and she has to lay down for an extended period to heal her back and uh -huh. get it all aligned. And she's a writer, so now she can lay down and write. Okay, let's see it. Voila! Oh. <laughs> wow! You want to demonstrate it? Yeah, sure. Okay. That's a great, that's a great invention. Thank you, Kyle.